It's Bernie Goldbach. I'm doing an audio about Christmas in Ireland because where I live in Cashel, it's underfoot. The, the, the uh, plaza turns blue. You go shopping during the day. The reflection of blue Cashel Christmas lights is just the way you mark the season. Christmas shopping, blue in Cashel. Um, Christmas shopping um, is when Christmas arrives on the scene for me. The buzz of people dashing every way and trying to get the presents for the people they love. For me, it's bustling city centre, shopping streets, branded bags and flashing lights. Uh, the Christmas tree is usually right in the middle of the shopping centre. Everyone will see it every day. Trees in Christmas is about behind the scenes of selecting cotton and mountain, then de decorating with colourful ornaments. Christmas dinner, crackers, uh, ripping them open even before you sit down, just total mayhem at a table. Uh, for me it's nights out, not only with uh, friends but with family also. Then also it's eating dinner, turkey obviously is a big part of Christmas. Mince pies, these are not perhaps as traditional in Ireland as they are in England, but are widely made and enjoyed just the same. For me it's being able to make the most of Christmas and being dressed up as Santa makes the most of, makes the most of it for me. <laughs> Uh, walking, walking on a cold, desolate road, dragging around presents for people you probably don't that like that much. There's some kind of depressed Santa. Uh, snowman is a big part of Christmas. I always make snowman every Christmas, so it really defines it for me. It doesn't snow every Christmas. Uh, red and green is traditionally Christmas colours, and I think a green holly on a red door simplifies Christmas for me in one shot. Uh, Christmas morning, the lights, decorations, uh, the sitting room, it's everything I think of when I think of Christmas. Uh, lights in Ireland are used to illuminate the streets and is a symbol that marks the occasion. Uh, Merry Christmas, Sheldon on a day.